Hello everyone, welcome to the Dalar to Rush. My name is Muhammad and in this video we're gonna really teach you how can you install new custom maps on Command and Conquer Rudalar 2. So without any further ado, intro. Watch and learn. Hello guys, welcome back here again. So now let me show you how can you download the maps from website and links all of it in the description down below and second how we can actually change the file type from MPR and YRM to MAP file third I will show you how can you actually install the maps by two ways you can actually do it to install the map so without any further ado let's jump to my computer and I will show you step by step how can you do it so now let me show you how can you actually do it because now we are on the computer it's so so easy the first thing you should get the file you know from all I told you all of it in the description down below so actually you can see as an example now I will show you only three files so as you can see the first one is YRM type file second one MAP type file and the third one MPR type file actually not all of them they are working just one type is working is MAP that's only type is working so now let me show you how can you actually install this three files inside the game itself so there's two ways the first one is as you can see you go to my computer and you go to C because in the beginning if you install the game in the C it should be in the C and remember you should have the CNC program with it because without it no custom map can actually download only on CNC okay so as you can see you can go to C and program file remember not only the program file is x86 only that one okay so after it you should look for origin origin games okay not origin origin games okay so after this you can, as you can see here command and conquer there are two so as you can see I'm, my game is not installed here because as you can see my C file is actually full so let me show you where is mine so as you can see is here so it should look something like this as you can see it should look something like this after this we went to maps not map render maps and then custom and as you can see here you can drag this files this three and put it here you can drag it and put it here so easy or copy paste whatever you want to do the second way how can you install the game itself it is so easy actually you do is right click and then open the file locate and so easy yeah and go to map render and custom and you do the same thing take the file drag it put it here again and voila that's the second way how can you do it so now I will show you inside the game let me show you mm -hmm. as you can see we don't have oh we have only just one map as you can see only this map we have now congratulations because I told you in the front only MAP type file is work so as you can see it's so good so how can we change the other type of files it's so easy I will show you the first thing is you can actually went to this file itself as you can see the map we're not gonna change it MAP we're gonna need it. What are you gonna do? The, the trick's so easy. Look, you go and rename and change this extension in the end and type MA, MAP and click OK and say you want to change the file extension to become unusable or whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Say absolutely yes. Next one, same thing. We do it MAP and click enter. Yes. So now let's go to the game. I will show you now as you can see mm, voila three maps as you can see look one two three great right three maps congratulations you have now three maps 
So if you like this video so far, make sure you like, share, and comment on the video, and subscribe, and ring the bell icon so you never miss any video from me. So without any further ado, let's continue the video. And the third way I want to tell you how you can actually get the maps, any maps that you want, is just play online. Join a room online and you can get this map. But I want to tell you something about it. You will get the map with awkward and weird names with it. If you want, really to search that file and you get it for yourself. I will show you what I mean. Look, if we look for this file, for example, I played online before and the name of it looks something like this. If you want to give it that map for a friend or even if you want just the file itself, you know, it's very very hard to do it, you know. So just rename something like this. Each one of these maps is different. When you go to inside the game, look, I will show you, I will drop some of these maps. and put it here I'll drop some of them and I'll open the game and ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. as you can see each one of them is different you see each one of them they have different names itself and all of it is right who's the author what is the name of the map which kind of like all the information about it all of it inside the game is totally fine, but when you get the file from outside the game, all of it's kind of like awkward, weird names, you know, on it. So it's very hard for you to just pick the right map from the custom file there. You know, sometimes the map is actually crashing, or sometimes it's not working, or sometimes you, what's happening, you enter the game, you play for a while, and it stop. Sometimes even the map itself does not work from the beginning, so in this case what are you going to do is look for the map itself, look for the file itself and delete it because you cannot do anything for it. Because some of them they are old maps, they made an old version of the, the program to make the maps itself. So what I highly highly recommend is just delete it altogether, you know. So what you actually can do if the map is actually crushing, you know. Sometimes when it's happening when it's crushing, there's actually two ways. You know, one of them, the map, is when you get inside, try is the windows, try to press it on your keyboard, and if you can get it outside, it's just fine. The other trick is that you can actually, you can do is hit control, alt, and delete together. After you get that extension out, you can see some kind of like a warning or something. So you hit okay, and you can get out from that game you played already.